Dear students, welcome to the Department of Collegiate and Technical Education. On behalf of Learning Management System Program of Department of Collegiate and Technical Education, I am presenting a video on 15 CS 5040 Clean Computing of 5th Semester Diploma in Computer Science and Engineering. Myself, Sheshadri A.V., Lecturer, Department of Computer Science and Engineering, Government Polytechnic, Chamarajanagar. So, in this session, I am presenting unit number 6 that is Green IT and Outlook. Here are the learning objectives of this session. First, we will look at the introduction part. In this topic, we will discuss how companies and institutions are adopting to sustainable computing and strategies. Then we will see why we need to think ecologically. Then we will see how Green IT is gaining popularity and growing significantly. How businesses, companies and training green computing to improve their profitability, competitiveness and innovations. The next topic is awareness to implementation. Here we will see why the IT sector and IT professionals are responsible to create sustainable environment. How the ICT is information and computer technology is responsible for GHG emissions globally. Then we will see how ICT is consuming total electricity consumption globally. Next we will see some of the green IT trends. First one measuring and reporting footprints. Second one demand for green transparency. Third one, customer engagement. Fourth one, green hardware and devices. Fifth one, telecommuting. Sixth one, green data centers. Seventh one, green awareness and responsibility. At the end of this session, we will have some assessments and MCQs to test the level of understanding. Let us look at the first topic. Is introduction. So nowadays, companies, educational institutions, and individuals are adopting sustainable computing strategies due to high energy costs. So, dear students, because of the high energy cost and high energy consumption, now companies, educational institutions, and individuals are adopting to sustainable computing strategies to reduce energy consumption and reduce the cost. So here we need to think more ecologically and the implementation of environmentally sustainable practices. So due to high energy cost and its impact on the environment, so we need to think more ecologically, environmentally friendly. So by the way, we have to implement environmentally sustainable practices to reduce the consumption of the energy. Green computing is gaining traction and growing in significance. So, so green IT is now gaining popularity and support and it is growing in significance in the view of high energy cost and ecological perspective. Nowadays, IT departments are driving enterprise-wide sustainability projects that improve their businesses, profitability, competitiveness and innovations. So, with your degree, Egina Dinagalali, IT department Kalu, Ate, CI Vogolo, the Tama on the company Galana, business Kalana Green Mada the Stella, other Jota Gain Martha and Tandre, Enterprise wide sustainability project Galana, run Martha Idre, Idrumukantra Yen on the Upyoga Agate and Tandre, our business na profitability increase Agate, competitiveness increase Agate, Ate, innovation gave Bala, scope your today. Agagi, Idinagalali, IT department, Kalu, company Kalu, so they are running sustainability projects. IT professionals will find green computing concepts becoming a bigger part of their work. IT professionals in Mundetama work Nali, Kalasadali, the green computing concept Galana, Tumba Arvars Kobekagate, Ekantandre. Green concepts in the 
ಇದು ಮುಂದೆ ಒಂದು ಬಿಗ್ಗರ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿಯರ್ ವರ್ಕ್ ಆಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಅವೇರ್ನೆಸ್ ಟು ಇಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟೇಷನ್ ಅವೇರ್ನೆಸ್ ಟು ಇಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟೇಷನ್ ಅಂತಂದರೆ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ಗಳನ್ನು ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯೂಟಿಂಗ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರಾಟಜಿಗಳನ್ನ ಇಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಮಾಡೋದ್ರಲ್ಲಿ ನಮಗೆ ಅವೇರ್ನೆಸ್ ಇರಬೇಕಾದದ್ದು ಬಹಳ ಮುಖ್ಯವಾದಂಥ ಸೊ ಹಾಗಾಗಿ ಯಾವ್ಯಾವ ಅವೇರ್ನೆಸ್ನಿಂದ ನಾವು ಈ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ಗಳನ್ನು ಇಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ವಿ ಅನ್ನೋದನ್ನು ನೋಡಿ ದ ಐ ಟಿ ಸೆಕ್ಟರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಪ್ರೊಫೆಷನಲ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಯೂಸರ್ಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಟು ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟ್ ಎ ಮೋರ್ ಸಸ್ಟೈನಬಲ್ ಎನ್ವಿರಾನ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಸೊ ನಬಡೇಸ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಸೆಕ್ಟರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಪ್ರೊಫೆಷನಲ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ವೆಲ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ದ ಯೂಸರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಐ ಟಿ ಪ್ರೊಡಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸರ್ವೀಸಸ್ ಆರ್ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಲ್ ಟು ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟ್ ಎ ಮೋರ್ ಸಸ್ಟೈನಬಲ್ ಎನ್ವಿರಾನ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಐ ಸಿ ಟಿ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯೂಟರ್ ಟೆಕ್ನಾಲಜಿ ಇಸ್ ಎ ಲಾರ್ಜ್ ಕನ್ಸ್ಯೂಮರ್ ಆಫ್ ಎನರ್ಜಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಗ್ಲೋಬಲಿ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ತ್ರೀ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಹೌಸ್ ಗ್ಯಾಸಸ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಜಿ ಹೆಚ್ ಜಿ ಎಮಿಷನ್ಸ್ ಯ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸಿ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯೂಟರ್ ಟೆಕ್ನಾಲಜಿ ಇಸ್ ಎ ಲಾರ್ಜ್ ಕನ್ಸ್ಯೂಮರ್ ಆಫ್ ಹೈ ಎನರ್ಜಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಗ್ಲೋಬಲಿ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ತ್ರೀ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಜಿ ಹೆಚ್ ಜಿ ಎಮಿಷನ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಓವರ್ಆಲ್ ಗ್ಲೋಬಲಿ ಎಷ್ಟು ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಹೌಸ್ ಗ್ಯಾಸಸ್ ಎಮಿಷನ್ ಆಗ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಅದರಲ್ಲಿ ಮೂರು ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಕಾಂಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಷನ್ನು ಎಲ್ಲಿಂದ ಬರ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಅಂತಂದರೆ ಐ ಸಿ ಟಿ ಅಂತಂದರೆ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕಂಪ್ಯೂಟರ್ ಟೆಕ್ನಾಲಜಿಯಿಂದನೇ ಬರ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಐ ಸಿ ಟಿ ಈಸ್ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ಫೈವ್ ಟು ಟೆನ್ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಟಿಪಿಕಲ್ ಎಕನಾಮಿಕ್ಸ್ ಟೋಟಲ್ ಎಲೆಕ್ಟ್ರಿಸಿಟಿ ಕನ್ಸಂಪ್ಷನ್ ಸೊ ಟೋಟಲ್ ಎಲೆಕ್ಟ್ರಿಸಿಟಿ ಜನರೇಟ್ ಏನಾಗ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಅದರಲ್ಲಿ ಐದರಿಂದ ಹತ್ತು ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಎಲೆಕ್ಟ್ರಿಸಿಟಿ ಐ ಸಿ ಟಿನೇ ಕನ್ಸ್ಯೂಮ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದೆ as green it is both a necessity and an opportunity businesses and it professionals have moved from asking can it go green to how can it go green so nowadays the green it is both necessity and as well as presenting more opportunities for businesses and it professionals so that's why it professionals and it businesses they are asking from can it go green to how can it go green so halavaru varshagal hinde it company galalli it business galalli ee green it concept galanna implement maduvaga halavaru samasyegalu bandalgalidvu yeno antandre it green aagabahuda anna ondu prashne iddittu so iga yenagide antandre it hege green aagabahudu ಅನ್ನುವಂಥ ಒಂದು ಸಿಚುವೇಶನ್ ನಿರ್ಮಾಣ ಆಗಿದೆ ಅಂತಂದರೆ ನಾವು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಗೋಗ್ರೀನಿಂದ ಹೌ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಗೋಗ್ರೀನ್ ಅನ್ನುವ ಒಂದು ಸಾಧ್ಯತೆಗೆ ನಾವು ಹೊರಳ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೀವಿ ಇನೋವೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಡೆವಲಪಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅಡಾಪ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಎನ್ವಿರಾನ್ಮೆಂಟ್ಲಿ ಸಸ್ಟೈನಬಲ್ ಐ ಟಿ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಎ ಕೀ ಟು ಸಕ್ಸಸ್ ನೌ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫ್ಯೂಚರ್ ಸೊ ಇಂಡಸ್ಟ್ರಿಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ಕಂಪನಿಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ಏನು ಇನೋವೇಷನ್ಸ್ ನಡೀತಾ ಇದೆ ಅದರಲ್ಲಿ ಡೆವಲಪ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಮತ್ತು ಎನ್ವಿರಾನ್ಮೆಂಟ್ಲಿ ಸಸ್ಟೈನಬಲ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸಸ್ನ ಅಡಾಪ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳೋದ್ರಲ್ಲಿ ಅದೇನಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತಂದರೆ ಇಟ್ ಕಾಂಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಸ್ ಟು ದಿ ಮೇಜರ್ ಸಕ್ಸಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಫ್ಯೂಚರ್ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಈಸ್ ನೋ ಪಾಸಿಂಗ್ ಫೇಡ್ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಈಸ್ ನೋ ಪಾಸಿಂಗ್ ಫೇಡ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಅನ್ನೋದು ಕೇವಲ ಒಂದು ಫ್ಯಾಷನ್ ಅಲ್ಲ ಅಥವಾ ಹೀಗೆ ಬಂದು ಹಾಗೆ ಹೋಗುವಂಥ ಒಂದು ಶಾರ್ಟ್ ಲಿವ್ಡ್ ಫ್ಯಾಷನ್ ಅಲ್ಲ ಅದು ಸೊ ಇದು ಬಹಳ ಕಾಲ ಇರುವಂಥದ್ದು ನೋ ಪಾಸಿಂಗ್ ಫ್ಯಾಡ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಎ ಫ್ಯಾಷನ್ ಆರ್ ಆ್ಯಕ್ಟಿವಿಟಿ ವಿಚ್ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ a short period of time and is not worth taking seriously adre green it idakke exception agirutade so green it enadu it is not just a passing fad idu kevala ondu salpa kala iruvantaddu athava ondu fashion ge iruvanta ondu concept alla idu dirga kala iruvantaddu matte industry nalli munde bala maatrav
first one measuring and reporting footprints second one demand for green transparency third one customer engagement fourth one green hardware and devices fifth one telecommuting sixth one green data centers and the last one is green awareness and responsibilities so it is to green it trends kalu. so ee na dinna galalli so it industry matte adaralli tovanta businesses galu so they are playing very bigger role and significant role in creating sustainable environment so hagagi ee this to green it trends galanna now alavadnus kondatte adalli now on the sustainable practices the model sustainable environment and now create model case at the other thing now let us look at the, the first IT trend green IT trend that is measuring and reporting footprints let us understand what is footprint is footprint is nothing but the carbon emission the total GHG emissions is called as carbon footprint or carbon emission the number of businesses are increasing that measure and report their carbon emission as part of their corporate social responsibility report so it is not the only thing that is not the company that is not the only thing that is not the only thing that is the company carbon emission yesterday that is not measure maadi that is not report maadta it is a part of their corporate social responsibility report so annually on the report now ru wonders there other than our corporate social responsibility report on the LTV he report now you're in Martha and Tandre I want to worship the Lee our company a carbon emission is to do is today another now report my enter to be transparent businesses must themselves know how much carbon emission they generate how much energy they consume the company go to transparent I get back on Tandre business school transparent I get back on Tandre so they must know how much carbon emission they are generating and how much energy they consuming so yes to energy and a consumer are there but the yes to carbon emission are going to now to generate Martha there are now the now to record my report more of a guy either more contra in on the achievement more about on Tandre company go to green concept currently transparent I go on on the I'm sure now get it or stop it businesses have begun to pay more attention to the eco-friendliness of their supply chain so one of the important factor in any business or any sector means it is the supply chain so if you want your enterprise to be green green concept kalana implement madabeku another even in my company a supply chain and an event madabeku eco-friendly agate back at the agagi in the nadine galali business kudu they are focusing more and paying more attention on the eco-friendliness of the supply chain. Many small and big businesses have taken steps to measure and report carbon footprint. So, the other company companies are still there. The other 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 companies are carbon footprint and measure and report and report and report and report and report and report and report. The government in a number of countries are mandating businesses to report and reduce their energy consumption and carbon footprint. So volunteer I guess tell a hello company go to Tava Gita way from a company a carbon footprint and a major money report more than that. Other just a game. Hello are they should really government in my day and then there. Yeah, they business early. Oh, our own do carbon footprint and now report more of a cool but the energy consumption and now. और वो रिड्यूस मार्ले भी को ये रीति वों तो कानून गलत ना हो संदेह दारे। नेक्स्ट ग्रीन आईटी ट्रेंड इस डिमांड फॉर ग्रीन ट्रांसपेरेंसी। कंज्यूमर्स हैव बिगन टू पे अटेंशन टू द ग्रीन क्रेडेंशियल्स ऑफ प्रोडक्ट्स और द सर्विसेज दे बाय एंड यूज। कंज्यूमर्स ये मार्टा इधर ह� तो अदर लिए न ग्रीन क्रेडेंशियल सिदे ये न ग्रीन कॉन्सेप्ट कर दे अनादर वाकी हेच्ची के गवर्नमेंट ने कोटा इधर है दे वांट टू नो वेयर प्रोडक्ट्स आर सोस्ट व्हाट आर दे मेड ऑफ एंड व्हाट देर कार्बन फुटप्रिंट इज कंज्यूमर्स आर आल्सो इंटरेस्टेड इन हाउ दी प्रोडक्ट्स आर सोस्ट 
how they are manufactured and what their carbon emission is. Businesses are responding to this demand by giving them more information about environmental aspects of their products and services. As the customers are demanding and paying more attention to the green credentials of the products, businesses are also equally responding to this demand by giving them more information about the environmental aspects of their products and services. So this thing that is customer demand and businesses response both are bringing the green transparency in products and services they use. The next IT trend is customer engagement. Businesses are now engaging customers and other stakeholders in sourcing their ideas and opinions actively in their green initiatives. Customers engagement is very very important to bring the very good ideas and opinions about the products. So green initiative gallery business kalu, tamma customer gallu matto stakeholder gallu na involve mad korte daren. Idu vandu vallaya belavani ke antane head bodu. Idrinda customers matte stakeholders orin mad tarre tamma liru vanta vandu uttam idea gallu na matto opinion gallu na a vandu business kalu ke company kalu ke head daga company gallu tamma product gallu na innu hichu eco-friendly agi, environmental friendly agi maadli ke help agatthen. For example, eBay launched a green team program to tap into the wisdom of customers. Ithe ke halavar udharangal anna kodu bohudu, ege customers matthe stakeholders ondhu product life cycle ali inwal aakta idare, ondhu business ali inwal aakta idare anna dhikke, ondhu udharangal anna pahantha andre, eBay, thavela nodir bohudu eBay company anna. So eBay company anna maadhi dhe anna andre, Green Team Program इन्नों वन्त वन्द प्रोग्राम अन्नादो लांच माड़िदे इदर मुखांत्र अवरा कस्टमर गळा वन्द विज्डम वन्द ओपिनियन मत्त एडिया कळन्न अवरू अलेक्ट माड़ी अधन इंप्लिमेंट माड़ता है दरे Another example is the GE Eco Imagination Challenge which seeks ideas for development and adoption of the smart grid and powering your home इन्नों वन्द example customer engagement इगे இன்னும் உதாரணை என்ன கொடுபோது ஏன் அந்தான்றது GE General Electric அவுரா GE Eco Imagination Challenge அன்னும் வந்தான் வந்து உதாரணை என்ன கொடுபோது இல்லி GE products கலந்த யூஜ் மாடு வந்தா customers இந்த அவரேன் மாட்தாய்தான் தன்றே idea கலந்த opinion கலந்த தகுத்துக்கொண்டு அதன்ன தம்ம smart grid கலல்லி மத்து powering system கலல்லை அவரு so using green hardware and devices is key to the environmental sustainability. So hence, manufacturers are also rolling out more green computers and green electronic devices and systems. So you are all aware that green hardware and device is nothing but a hardware or device which is energy efficient and eco-friendly. So eager manufacturers in Martha and Tandre, so green computer गळन्ना, green electronic product गळन्ना, green system गळन्ना आवरु market के बिड़िगड़े माणता है तरे इदिर इन्दा की energy efficiency हिच्च आगत्ते, carbon emissions गड़में आगत्ते अधर मुल्का नावु, उन्द sustainable environment ना create माड़ लिके सहया आगत्ते for instance, several green IT products are PCs, notebooks, computers, monitors, printers and others Green hardware मत्ते devices के हलवार exam करनाने कोड़बे कांता नरे आवो personal computers गलाना नोड़ बोधु notebook computers गलाना नोड़ बोधु monitors, printers, servers, networking devices इके हलवारू green hardware मत्ते devices इंदो market नले नमगे available इते Electronic Product Environmental Assessment Tool EPEAT it labels of gold, silver and bronze are now available. So as you are aware that EPEAT that is Environmental Electronic Product Environmental Assessment Tool. So is it assessment tool to categorize the electronic devices and hardware into gold, silver and bronze category. So even small companies and individuals are turning to recycling and learning how to dispose of equipment in eco-friendly ways. Not just big companies, 
even small companies and individuals are also learning how to recycle and how to dispose the electronic equipments in eco-friendly ways. The next green IT trend is telecommuting. Let us understand what is telecommuting is. Telecommuting is the concept of working from home. That is, employees need not go to the employer's place or the offices. Instead, they carry out their day-to-day -day work from home itself or from the co-working areas. With the use of voice over internet protocol or VoIP, telecommuting is becoming more popular among businesses. So especially IT and IT services field are adopting to this telecommuting procedure. So this is enabled because of the VoIP services and hence telecommuting is become more popular now. Companies are now offering their employees the option of telecommuting. So after COVID, you might have seen most of the offices are running from the home. Means the employees are working from home. They are not going to the employer's place or offices. Companies also, they are offering their employees from work from home options. An attractive option is in age of high fuel prices, traffic jams and long commutes. So telecommuting is an attractive option for the employers as well as for employees in the age of high fuel prices, traffic jams and long commutes. The next green IT trend is green data centers. First let us understand what is a data center is. Data center is a building or a place dedicated to host the computing equipments such as hard disk, processors, networking devices, communication devices. So these data centers host a variety of web applications, popular e-commerce sites and social networks. So these data centers, they provide uninterrupted services throughout the time that is 24 into 7. So hence they are hosting a popular web applications, popular e-commerce sites and social networks. These data centers, they consume very high energy because they need to run over time. So hence these data centers need to be green. These are becoming greener with significant improvement in energy efficiency. With the article, data center galu nimge gutiro hage ati hechu energy na consume martave matte heat na produce martave. Hagagi namma data center galanna navu green maadu anta ondu avashyakate thumba ide. So ee nittinalli so data center galanna navu energy efficient agi navu maadbeku. So avu kadme energy alli hechige kala run aguvanta ondu avashyakate yottu bahala ide. The use of greener cleaner power sources for their operations. So we need to provide a green energy, a clean energy power sources for the operation of data centers. This makes the data center green. The final green IT trend is green awareness and responsibility. Among businesses and individuals, environmental awareness and responsibility are increasing. So there is an increased environmental awareness and responsibility among businesses, companies, enterprises, and as well as individuals. For instance, the use of power management features and products has increased. In computer and hardware, we have power management features and products. In the product, we have power management features implemented. So, in this case, Green initiative is a contribution. Customers are willing to pay more for green IT products. Customers also are ready to pay more for green IT products because green IT products are energy efficient and eco friendly. So, this is because of the, the awareness and the responsibility among the businesses and individuals. Now, let us summarize. The session. Initially, we discussed introduction. In the introduction part, we saw 
how companies and institutions are adapting to sustainable computing strategies due to high energy cost and prices later on we discussed how we need to think ecologically and why we need to think ecologically and implementation of the environmentally sustainable practices then we discussed about how green it is gaining popularity and growing significantly how businesses and companies are turning green to improve their profitability competitiveness and innovations next we discussed about awareness to implementation it sector and it professionals are responsible to create sustainable environment and ict is responsible for 3% of global ghg emissions ict is consuming 5 to 10% of total electricity com- consumption later on we discussed about various green it trends and key sustainability factors some of them are measuring and reporting carbon footprint carbon footprint means it is the total ghg emissions or carbon emissions so nowadays the companies and businesses are measuring and reporting the carbon emission as part of corporate social responsibility report the so next trend is demand for green transparency uh, customers are demanding for green credentials of the products and services they buy and use because of increased awareness the companies are also fulfilling the customers demand of green credentials the next green it trend is customer engagement customer engagement is a key factor in developing sustainable environment and green products we saw the two initiatives in the programs so one is ebay's green team program and second one is ge's ecomization challenge these are used to tap the ideas and opinions of the customers and stakeholders the next green it trend is green hardware and devices the use of green hardware and devices is significantly contributing to the sustainable environment and green concepts so some of the green hardware and devices are pcs notebooks monitors servers and printers the next green it trend is telecommuting telecommuting means the employees are working from their home itself or from co working areas so instead of going to the office or employees place by commuting long distances by paying high fuel prices and having the trouble of traffic jams so now companies are offering their employees with the option of telecommuting which is a very good idea from the perspective of green initiatives and creating sustainable environment the next green it trend is green data centers data centers are buildings which are hosting several web applications popular e-commerce sites and social networks these data centers they consume very high energy in the businesses so hence the data centers need to be green how can we make the greater centers green by using clean and en- green energy so which reduces energy consumption as well as the carbon emission the final green it trend is green awareness and responsibility so nowadays individuals small businesses and big businesses are also they are having the awareness and responsibility towards green using these green it trends so we can create a sustainable environment a green environment to prepare the content of this session i have referenced the prescribed textbook that is harnessing green it principles and practices by san morrison and jr gangadharan now let us see some of the assessments and mcqs here is a descriptive question regarding this session that is explain various key sustainability and green it trends so for this question so you need to answer the various green it trends like measuring and reporting carbon footprints demand for green transparency customer engagement green hardware and devices telecommuting 
in data centers green awareness and responsibility so i have to explain briefly all these green it trends so here is the first mcq it reads out like this to be transparent businesses must themselves know how much carbon emission they generate andre ondu business transparent agirbeku anta andre ಆ ಕಂಪನಿಯವರು ಆ ಬಿಸ್ನೆಸ್ಸು ಎಷ್ಟು ಕಾರ್ಬನ್ ಎಮಿಷನ್ನ ಜನರೇಟ್ ಮಾಡುತ್ತೆ ಅನ್ನೋದನ್ನು ತಿಳಿದುಕೊಳ್ಳೋದು ಅವಶ್ಯಕವಾಗಿರ್ತದೆ ಅನ್ನೋ ಒಂದು ಒಂದು ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಇದೆ ದ ಚಾಯ್ಸಸ್ ಆರ್ ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ ಎ ಟ್ರೂ ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ ಬಿ ಆಲ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದಿ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಐ ಟಿ ಟ್ರೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ನಾವು ಯು ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಬಿ ಏಬಲ್ ಟು ಚೂಸ್ ದ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ದ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಎಮ್ ಸಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಈಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಫಾಲೋಸ್ ಮೆಜರಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ರಿಪೋರ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಕಾರ್ಬನ್ ಎಮಿಷನ್ಸ್ is part of corporate social responsibility report so companies are nowadays they are measuring and reporting their carbon emission as part of their corporate social responsibility report so ee one statement is sarina tappu anadanna now decide madbekagutte so choices are obviously choice a false and choice b true the third mcq customers want to know where products are sourced what they are made of and what their carbon footprint is called choice a green transportation choice b green transmission choice c green transparency choice d none of the above so customers tamma product galanna hege manufacturing madidare so adralli yava material alanna use madidare mattu ಆ ಮೆಟೀರಿಯಲ್ಗಳ ಒಂದು ಆ ಪ್ರಾಡಕ್ಟ್ಗಳ ಕಾರ್ಬನ್ ಫುಟ್ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಏನು ಅನ್ನೋದನ್ನು ತಿಳ್ಕೊಳ್ಳೋವಂಥ ಒಂದು ವಿಷಯವನ್ನು ನಾವು ಒಂದು ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಪೋರ್ಟೇಷನ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ಬೋದು ಅಥವಾ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಮಿಷನ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ಬೋದು ಅಥವಾ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಪರೆನ್ಸ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ಬೋದು ಅಥವಾ ಯಾವುದು ಅಲ್ಲ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ಬೋದು ಸೊ ಈ ಒಂದು ನಾಲ್ಕು ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಚಾಯ್ಸನ್ನು ನೀವು ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಚೂಸ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕಾಗತ್ತೆ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಎಮ್ ಸಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಈಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಫಾಲೋಸ್ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ ಎಂಗೇಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಇನ್ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಇನಿಷಿಯೇಟಿವ್ಸ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಇನಿಷಿಯೇಟಿವ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ಗಳ ಎಂಗೇಜ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಅಥವಾ ಒಳಗೊಳ್ಳುವಿಕೆ ಭಾಳ ಮುಖ್ಯವಾದದ್ದಲ್ಲ ಅನ್ನೋ ಒಂದು ಒಂದು ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಇದೆ ಚಾಯ್ಸಸ್ ಆರ್ ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ ಎ ಟ್ರೂ ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ ಬಿ ಫಾಲ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ನಾವು ಯು ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಚೂಸ್ ದಿ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಫೈನಲ್ ಫಿಫ್ತ್ ಎಮ್ ಸಿ ಕ್ಯೂ ಈಸ್ ಟೆಲಿಕಮ್ಯೂಟಿಂಗ್ ಇಸ್ ಆನ್ ಅಟ್ರಾಕ್ಟಿವ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಇನ್ ಆನ್ ಏಜ್ ಆಫ್ ಹೈ ಫ್ಯೂಯಲ್ ಪ್ರೈಸಸ್ ಟ್ರಾಫಿಕ್ ಜಾಮ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಲಾಂಗ್ ಕಮ್ಯೂಟ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಚಾಯ್ಸಸ್ ಆರ್ ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ ಎ ಟ್ರೂ ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ ಬಿ ಫಾಲ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಟೆಲಿಕಮ್ಯೂಟಿಂಗ್ ಅನ್ನೋದು ಇತ್ತೀಚಿನ ದಿನಗಳಲ್ಲಿ ಭಾಳ ಒಂದು ಅಟ್ರಾಕ್ಟಿವ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಆಗಿದೆ ಏಕೆ ಅಂತಂದರೆ ಹೈ ಫ್ಯೂಯಲ್ ಪ್ರೈಸಸ್ ಟ್ರಾಫಿಕ್ ಜಾಮ್ಸ್ ಮತ್ತು ಲಾಂಗ್ ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಟ್ರಾವೆಲ್ನಿಂದಾಗಿ ಟೆಲಿಕಮ್ಯೂಟಿಂಗ್ ಇವತ್ತು ಭಾಳ ಪಾಪ್ಯುಲರ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ಆಗಿದೆ ಸೊ ಇದು ಸರಿನ ಅಥವಾ ತಪ್ಪು ಅನ್ನೋ ಒಂದು ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಇದು ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ ಎ ಟ್ರೂ ಇದೆ ಚಾಯ್ಸ್ ಬಿ ಫಾಲ್ಸ್ ಇದೆ ಸೊ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಚೂಸ್ ದಿ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ dear students we have arrived at the end of this session finally i would like to thank my team who supported me and helped me in preparing and presenting this video to you thank you one and all